can of uh, can of raining in case you hadn't noticed that you know I'm just saying hey everyone this is the burning donut reporting as live as possible in recorded format and uh, it's kind of kind of rainy in fact I almost guarantee that just like every other person who's done a vlog of some kind with a fucking GoPro in the rain there's gonna be at least that one drop that's gonna be right in the way of everything so yeah it's always that point where they try to wipe it off it's it worse too This is gonna be my second day of bell ringing for the Salvation Army. It's exactly as I remember it. About as unorganized as always. One of the things about internet drama is that that's exactly what it is. Drama on the internet. If you can escape the internet, you no longer have to be part of the drama. In other words, if you go into reality, it no longer has to affect you. Now, there are a lot of people who don't have that escape. Their lives are so attached to the life on the magic box that they literally have nothing else going for them. There is, they have no life. They have nothing to look forward to. Oh. Getting this ambassador. Well, that guy's making a project out of it. But, they don't have this. They don't have the outside world to go to. There are, there are times where I don't have the outside world to go to. Bend is a very weather-centric town, so when winter comes around, there's not as much to do, not as many places to go. So I spend way too much time on the internet, getting way too affected by things on the internet. Part of the problem with the internet is it doesn't take into account reality. It doesn't take into account real life. Wow. Hey, there's someone ran over a skunk or there's some good weed around here. I'm just trying to pass. Is the best way to handle internet drama to get off the fucking internet for a while and focus on the real issues you're dealing with. And I know I'm on the sidewalk. Oh, but wow! <laughs> I know, right? <laughs> Unfortunately, where I need to go is on that side, and the closest crosswalk is clear at the other end. So this is theoretically faster. I don't mind getting a little wet. And there he goes. There is a bike lane on this side. Personally, I would rather be going the wrong way on the sidewalk than in the bike lane. Oh yeah, all the internet drama is just, it's just bullshit. And dealing with people on the internet, they're often, at least the drama oriented people, are often a couple bricks short of a, of a stack, if you know what I'm saying. Oh yeah, 
things can happen sometimes. You accidentally get down to their level, and then shit happens. Like with me. But it's a learning experience. So I'm just gonna move on with life and all that type of shit. And say fuck it. Right? It is certainly fucking windy. Holy shit. Don't go. Gonk, gonk. All right, well, this is my uh, bell ringing spot, so I'll catch you all later. Donut out.